On today's episode, we will be discussing residential life with Amanda here. Hi folks, I'm Amanda Gracioso, Director of Residential Life and Dining Services. So, today. Amanda, <laughs> we had a lot of questions about when freshmen will get their housing assignments. Sure, so starting mid-July, we're actually in the process of assigning right now. Uh, later this month, you'll be able to go back to your housing application on the confirmation page to find out where you're living and who you're going to live with. Hi, we're here in Blair Hall, one of our residence halls on campus, and you guys asked us the question, what comes in a dorm room? So we have beds right here in every room. And these are the drawers that come with every single room like this. And what's cool about the beds is that you can um, raise them up higher so you can fit these drawers right underneath it. You can also bunk it with the other bed. There are also desks in every room. Great for putting your school supplies in them. And then each one will have a closet where you can keep your stuff and drawers underneath. Some rooms also have walk-in closets where they're built into the rooms. Hope to see you soon. So oh, I lived on the fourth floor of Pemmy my freshman year and I met so many kids that I still talk to today. I built many long-lasting friendships and residence halls are a great opportunity to do that. Hey there, here we are in Pemmy Hall, one of our residential buildings on campus. Every single building comes with a lounge area for students. This one has a pool table, vending machines, foosball, and a nice lounge area with a big flat screen TV and some ping pong tables. Foundation, a local food pantry just for students, and it also has a quiet study room so if your neighbor's being too loud, you can just go right on downstairs and study. And be sure to join us every Tuesday starting at noon on Plymouth State's Instagram page for Ask Me Anything Tuesday. Just to ask current students anything that may be on your mind. That's all folks! <laughs>